The colony seems to have made significant progress. Perhaps it is time we began phase two of the trial. Agreed. I will prepare the feeder colonies. Let's ease them in with a familiar disturbance. Introduce 20 Formica Fusca ants. The Fusca colony is attached, and the ants are on their way. I see they haven't lost their potency. Now let's try the Formica Rufa ants. The Rufa will be more aggressive. Our Raptors will need to put up a strong defense. Adding 20 Rufa ants. Once again, our raptors have neutralized the threat to their queen. Good. Continue the experiment as before. But don't push the colony too hard. Of course not. That would be... irresponsible. Introducing 40 Rufa ants. Excellent defense. Increasing to 50 Rufa ants. be unfair to help the colony out? Perhaps. But I'm feeling generous. Collect your seeds swiftly, my little ants. Now, let's see how they handle the Rufa and the Fusca invaders. We will start with 30 of each. A wonderful victory on two fronts. Perhaps we should try three colonies this time. 
Introducing 30 of each, Rufa, Fusca, and Raptor Ants. Good, good. A little helping hand for what comes next. Collect it quickly. Faster, faster! Hmm, I wonder how long they will survive against a sustained flow from all three colonies. Let's see. doing well, my intrepid raptors, but what's this? A giant tiger beetle has joined the fray. And another, and another. Oh no, three tiger beetles. work, my little ants. But what's this? One, two, three, uh, nine, ten wolf spiders. It hardly seems fair. The queen is in danger. Perhaps I should stop the experiment. The queen is in danger. Perhaps I should stop the experiment. Yes, yes! Victory to the Raptor! What's going on here? Uh, yes, the, the ants performed excellently against the Rufa. They just staved off an attack from 40 Rufa ants. 40? I think that's enough for now. We don't want to overstress them. Agreed. 